Hello, this is Jim Clary, and I'm the Senior Geek. In this video, I'm going to describe briefly changing your default search engine within the Safari browser for your iPhone or your iPad from the Google that uh, comes with it from Apple, the Google search being the default, to DuckDuckGo being the default search engine. Why are we looking at DuckDuckGo? Well, if you've got a concern about privacy on, on using Google as your search engine, then DuckDuckGo is certainly an alternative that you may want to consider. We know that Google does gather information for advertising purposes because that's how they make most of their money, quite frankly. Some people are, are comfortable with that, others are not. If you're not and you want to consider a search engine that um, protects your privacy a little bit more, DuckDuckGo, in my opinion, is a good alternative. What I've got here is a DuckDuckGo.com. You can just go to your web browser and put that in the, uh, the address bar. I'm sorry, I'll get my terminology straightened out here in a second. And uh, you can flip through and, and read about it. You can, you can also, and I'll just use Google, um, DuckDuckGo. Now, we use Google as a generic. I think it really means search. And you could actually Google something using DuckDuckGo, I guess. Uh, anyway, um, if you're interested in, in changing from Google to the uh, DuckDuckGo, just hold on for a minute. Uh, I'll be right back with you on this video, and uh, we'll take a look at our iPhone and iPad and, and see exactly how to, how to make that. Okay, see you when I get my phone out. Okay, let's uh, first uh, find your settings app. Go on the little funny gear things here. Let's tap on that, then um, uh, scroll on down to, we get to Safari, click on there. Then we go to Search Engine. Right now mine's set at Google, that's the default out of the box. In fact, I think Google pays Apple to do that. Anyway, we can now though check DuckDuckGo and um, go back now. Let's go over to and open up Safari. And when we do, let's do a, you can initiate a search by question mark, question mark, leather. I know it's kind of a broad set category, couldn't think of anything else. And let's say we want to search for weather channel. And you see, it works that way, but you can see here we used uh, DuckDuckGo. If you do want to use Google for some reason, um, that's real simple. You could just go up here on your bar and just type Google. Just go to google.com, boom. When you do, you could type your um, search for Google right here. Now it's gonna fuss at you about Google's and want you to go back to Google, but you've made your decision. Hope this is helpful. Um, if you like this video, if you can give me a thumbs up on YouTube, and also um, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, The Senior Geek, and uh, leave any comments or anything. I, I always welcome those. Anyway, this is your Senior Geek. Take care. Hope to see you on another video soon.